get that app to go. I want to work on it. She doesn't like you, all right? When's it going to penetrate? As soon as you go away. Maybe. Now wrap it up and get it to go. Quickly. Go now. Eat shit now. Three. One, two, don't, don't three. Do don't do that. Go. Get out of here. You're a Neanderthal, Stuart. You know that you really are. I know that. I know. I know. No, that. you're really growing. You're really. You're growing as a person. That's important. Maybe we'll chill out, Stan. Maybe. You get out of here. No, I thought we were a slice of pizza. I think there's a danger in our being over friendly. How can we be over friendly if we aren't even friendly? He's got a point. It's a great book. You're gonna love it. I've read it four times. You know, I've often felt like the main okay. character, Holden Caulfield. Mm -hmm. No, no, you're not Holden Caulfield. He's Stratladder, you know, the obnoxious roommate, the one that thinks he's a stud, <laughs> and falls Holden down to his coat without asking, stretches it out, and doesn't apologize. <laughs> it's a good book. <laughs> I always felt like a little sister. Phoebe? Yeah. Have you read Franny and Zoe, or Nine Stories? Yeah, they're, they're not as good, though. You know, one time, my mom, she actually met J.D. Salinger. Really? It's a true story. She threw up on his front lawn. Really? Yeah. She was on vacation in Maine um, with her best friend, and they met these two sailors who were at Port for the night. They got really drunk, and these sailors took them. Before the long, and Alex and I were wrapped in conversation. <laughs> and Stuart was not. <laughs>